कैसे हो भाई लोग यहाँ बैठे बैठे गांड फड़ गई लेडीज एंड जेंटमैन वाइल द इंटरनेट वॉज ट्रॉन कैंसल जी टी एस सिक्स दैट्स राइट सक इज ट्रॉन कैंसल जी टी एस सिक्स राइट नाउ देर इज हैश टैग बैन जी टी एस सिक्स ट्रेंडिंग वाइल दैट्स हैपनिंग वर्ग बी चेक आउट जी टी एस सिक्स वर्स इज रियल लाइफ Yeah, this is gonna be that video. Like this video, subscribe if you're brand new. Get your double hammers ready because dog, this has happened in real life. So obviously we all saw this happen in the game, in the game trailer. It's happening in the game, but there's a real life video. Roll it. It says neighborhood watch. Don't play around in Hamlet. So we know that Hamlet is a new area in the game. Crazy, and you can see man. here, it is this lady that's wearing like her house slippers and what looks to be like this pajama <laughs> dress, dual wielding a set of Hamlet. She's literally in her Crocs. I don't want to do it. I know this is so old, but what are those? What are those? And she has something very specific to say to Lucha Libre fan. Well, look who's back. She says, well, look who's back. Clearly, this is a confrontation that she's had before, and this is actually based on a real video. I think this was back in 2020 of a woman destroying cars, dual wielding hammers. This is the most wild thing I've ever seen. I'll show you a quick snippet of that video so you can compare the version in GTA 6 to the version in real life. Wild stuff, man. Get the fuck Holy. out of this neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo. Yep. Hey. Cool, lady. Come on, please. Chill, bro. Chill, huh? Damn, bro. Double hammer. Now, the that's next thing crazy. that's based off of a real life event is this shot from the trailer right here. It's coming from Mega. We got a drug, you know. When I look at this guy, I guess I'm reminded of Free Tenga. You know what I mean, right? I love the guy, man. I love the guy. I love the guy. He runs a Sony Pony Patrol channel, X Bot Patrol channel. He's like a fanboy channel, which I love enjoying sometimes to time. Okay, this is where I get my 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 uh, Sony Pony Sawyer and uh, X Bot Sawyer, right? So he, I imagine he looks like this though. Probably doesn't, but I imagine though. Do not send this video to the guy. I love that. If, if you send it, yo Fratenga, let me send you some kisses. No homo. Love you, my brother. Love you, mommy. Don't, Mundo. don't make a video on me though, otherwise I won't love you. Or make me a, make a video on me, it's fine. it's fine. News, which I believe is like a parody of Univision or Telemundo, one of the Spanish broadcast channels that you might see. And if you're wondering what this translation says, it states, confession written in ink for tattoos, a tattoo on the neck that gave himself away, key in the conviction of a Leonida man. And you can Bruh. see this guy's got tattoos all over his face, he's got purple hair. This is actually based off of a real life dude known as the Miami Joker. So Holy. Lauren Sullivan, who's a 30 year old man, is a tattoo model from Miami. He achieved internet infamy when he was arrested in 2017 on charges that he pointed a gun at passing vehicles, revealing his colorful tattoo filled mugshot. And he was dubbed the Miami Joker. And Damn. since then, he has gained internet fame on all social media accounts. But you guys can see there, the Rockstar basically just changed him up a little bit. Instead of green hair, he's got purple hair. Uh, obviously his tattoos aren't a 100% match, but this is definitely the guy they're modeling this whole thing after. That that is absolutely spot on. There is some really crazy stuff that happens in Florida, and I can't wait to see Rockstar sort of give us a parody of all of that in GTA 6. Yeah. Now, this next shot from the trailer, I actually thought this might have been a real-life DJ, and I believe it has since been confirmed. And the reason oh, I yeah? thought that this DJ might be real is because she looked very specific, like her hairstyle, her glasses, all the tattoos on her arm. And this is Peggy Go. Hopefully, I'm pronouncing her name correctly. She is a South Korean DJ, singer, and songwriter, as well as a record producer. Producer. She is exceptionally popular, and it looks like she is going to be featured in Grand Theft Auto 6. Okay, now, this should come as her? no surprise. Rockstar I mean, that's a W for her. W for her. Absolutely loves their DJs, their nightclubs, their music sets. I mean, heck, they even have their own record label, Circle Loco Records. They've done so much with music in Grand Theft Auto Online, so it is not surprising at all to see this game. Man, this game is going to be a banger, bro. Like, it's going to have so many, like, real-life events. Uh, I, I hope he shows that video, too. You know, there was a girl that was uh, shaking twerking on top of the car like we had a dump truck bruh absolutely nasty absolute degenerate behavior but suckers be doing that in real life though continued over into GTA 6 and it looks like Peggy is not the only Do one that, that is going to be featured as far as the music side of things and this I guess parody of Instagram shot right here high rollers mag on the show high rollers lifestyle this is actually Rod Wave he's an American rapper singer and songwriter best known for his hip-hop and R&B songs so how cool is that that Rockstar seems to be incorporating some pretty famous musical <laughs> celebrities into the game now they might yeah. not be huge parts of the story but you yep. might be able to see Peggy go at a nightclub Club. You might be able to see Rod Wave on TV. Man, this shot looks so good though. Like it, it just feels so real. Look at the clouds in the background though. Look at the lights. Look at that car light hitting the other light. 
uh, other car, I should say, not the light. Bruh. Bro. Bruh. Look at the car light hitting the back of that. And, and my my brother be and brother be like this, right? Like putting the finger like that. Brother, brother, put that finger down, brother. So brother be doing that on his own Instagram parody program. All of that is really awesome. Now, there's a handful of other things in the trailer that are based on real life events in Florida too. Like for example, this one from Official Poach. Stay alert, Vice City. Remember to check for uninvited guests before the pool party. Literally, this is a guy pulling an app. Yo, okay, this cannot be real. So we have a real life version, real life video of something like that as well. God, hey, right? Alligator see. out of the pool on a local Florida news station. So I guess that legitimately happens a lot for people who have pools in Florida. I guess that's no, is that normal? I mean, I did ask the question like on uh, on a video the other day as well uh, on the stream, I should say. And some seconds were saying like, nah, it's not that not that much. But in Orlando, there's a uh, uh, frequent. It can be frequent. This is crazy, though. I don't think it's that frequent, but it can happen, I guess. Right. Damn. my Look at that brother, though. Dude be chilling, though. That's a thing. Maybe dude be like smash a like button, I'm saying, Papa. Maybe that's one of the reasons why they have their pools mostly covered in Florida. I don't know. You guys can let me know in those comments Holy. down below. Believe it or not, there's also people that end up twerking on top of vehicles coming from have a vice. That is absolute degenerate behavior, though. I mean, listen, I love me the pom pom. Don't get me wrong. I love me. I'm a straight male. I love me that pom pom. Don't chase that pom pom. Chase your dreams and smash a like button, guys. But like this is crazy, bruh. Like some this happened in real life though, which is the wildest thing. Oh shit! Oh shit! Stay. Someone wildest called the Department thing. of Transport on this dump truck. Yes, there have legitimately been videos, viral videos going around of individuals twerking on top of vehicles riding down the road. Definitely not safe. Behavior. Certainly interesting. And speaking of interesting, <laughs> an alligator. <laughs> interesting. Hey, yo, listen, man. Definitely not safe, guys. Mr. Bosch for the win approved. <laughs> Yay. Gator Mr. going Boss into a convenience store. Approves. Yep, that's definitely happened, and it certainly what? happened in Florida. Gator scare at Walmart. So they are really going to have some realistic life-like events occur. It really does seem like Florida has the weirdest stuff that happens to them. And we're not done yet. What about Planet Leonida Man? Oh, you usually got to hit no, the strip club this. to see Jiggle like that for real. That apparently has happened, where you just see naked dude. Dog, like, dog, I just can, bro. I just can. Like, imagine you're a cop, right? And you see somebody like with their bbc hanging out like that <laughs> bro like out like that nah, bro this would be me like that nah, bro, hey, bro, hey, bro, hey, bro, hey, bro. i'm not i'm not doing anything though you know i'm not touching like hey, bro, hey, bro. You, know, you know what i'm saying like hey bro damn man man hanging with the bbc if you're a cop bro like would you like any cops watching my video though like hey yo hey yo any cops watching my video, if you're a cop and you see somebody with their BBC or BWC hanging out fully like that, and you gotta arrest them, would you arrest them? I mean, damn, and shout out to the, the cops, man. Shout out to the cops, man. Sometimes they be uh, handling tough situations. Tough. Strolling around at gas stations and the police got to end up dealing with it. And what about guys randomly watering their lawn and nothing but basically a thong in the nude? Yep, you guessed it. Florida man does yard work naked. I guess you're technically... Dog, a and I was like doing this, right? Because I couldn't see well. So I was like, bruh. Man, okay, I got caught. I got exposed on video, bro. I shouldn't have done that. Allowed to do that. And what about this Weasel News report? No overturning zone. Cops arrest man who flipped his car after Pee Wee's dine and dash. And you guys can see there, there's an overturned car in the middle of what looks to be a very busy highway. Weasel and sure news, enough, yeah. that exact same thing happened in Florida. Holy. And Rockstar even got it almost perfect with the overturned car. The cops chasing in on the scene. You've also got the same sort of color style on the police vehicles. The attention to detail here from Rockstar is astounding. Man. And there's a Holy. handful of other examples that Rockstar seem to have pulled from pop culture. There might not be one specific example that grabs like major news headlines, but the guy doing a crotch grab for an apology for bad driving, you've certainly seen that happening. Driving like this, where you literally aren't even in the vehicle, I'm sure that has been... Sp See you in heaven, cuz. <laughs> Spotted before. There's definitely real life examples of the Thrill Billy Mud Club and Yeah, that's Tim the Tatman. This is Tracy. Yo, Tim the Tatman in the back looking kinda like wow dude. Like yeah, damn Tim. Little Timmy in the back as well. Yo, I'm gonna like try and like going frame by frame, trying to rewind a little bit here though. Like look at that. That's Tim! Oh shit! That's Timmy! 
looking at his bunna or something like looking at her bunna i should say club and people that act like that as well as other small news snippets like the dirt she for the streets though guys like don't dirt don't, don't don't stay focused stay that's focused. actually something i've seen believe it or not in real life happening Wait, where what? The dirt bike dirt bags that's actually something i've seen believe it or not in real life happening where dirt bikes like this actually shut down the roads and the highways completely so it is something that i have seen and rockstar are going to be in court damn mr boss surely is a wild boy he's a wild boy me incorporating it in grand theft auto 6 which is absolutely wild and like i mentioned earlier the game of course is based on miami and its surrounding areas so there's going to be a lot of roads and buildings you see that 100 percent match the all I see is just ass here, bro. There's just so much ass, man. Where are the buildings? I don't see any buildings here. There's just so much. <laughs> the world i feel like i want to save those examples for like an updated mapping video but in this one i wanted to show you sort of all like the pop culture references that rockstar have made to real life here and there's a ton of them just in this trailer alone so it really does make you wonder how much more rockstar have up their sleeve that we're gonna get man to this is still a story in development i cannot wait till seconds find more guys click on this video on the screen this is that video where seconds are asking for gta 6 to be canceled though Suckers are dead ass like yeah they're demanding for GTA 6 to be cancelled. Why you ask, right? Click on this video on the screen. We talked about it. Should it be cancelled? Should it not be? Check it out and I'll see you right there.